Hello, I'm Naviza, a final year student of the Computer Science Department at the Salim Habib University and today we're going to talk about my life at SHU. Why I chose Salim Habib University is because SHU was actually a blessing as uh, they took me in their fourth round of uh, October. One major kick of motivation was that they were providing scholarships for all the new students and uh, when I visited the university, the infrastructure, the architecture, the major labs, computer science labs, libraries, I basically loved it and being a sports enthusiast, seeing the sports complex, Fatma Sports Complex and the football ground, I really loved it in the first glance so I have always wanted to study computer science ever since 8th grade even though um, I wanted to be become a neurologist ever since I was in my first grade that was like when I was six years old uh, moving on in my 8th grade when I had to choose between computer sciences medical commerce arts so my dad believed that I should opt for computer science as he knew me better so he thought that I could use my skills into that a particular de uh, department and I think that he chose the right thing for me. I was not really sure what I would do in computer science when I was first uh, opting for it in school or even in college but I've always been a creative person and also a technical person and I wanted to integrate both of that since I had no idea what I want to do. Uh, computer science looked really cool to me so and I really wanted to learn the skills that computer science was to learn in it, the networks course. So I thought that cyber security and information security is the one for me since I've always wanted to do something in criminolo criminology too. Um, my ideas have always been all over the place. Sometimes I want to be a neurologist, a criminologist and something, I don't know. But computer science was the degree that basically lets me do all of it being at one place you could choose whatever you want to do okay so speaking about my academic journey as I've been an overachiever in school and uh, college both but uh, university it is a completely different environment uh, university may you are on your own apni responsibility khud leni padti hai teachers and professors are not gonna spoon feed you so initially I took it very lightly ke just most students are ke jo hoga dekha jayega and a lot of uh, time was spent in fun and games with friends but then in the second semester i realized that academic is very important for my degree and for my future so um, even though i have been a good student but there was a major decline in my grade since uh, computer science is a very advanced and very professional course and agar aapko pichli zyada know how nahi hai to you will suffer but since maine 8th 9th 10th 11th mein computer science kiya tha so it was not a big issue for me agar aapko design karne ka bahut shauk and you want to do something in science so computer science is the one for you since i am somebody who wants to work for cyber security to mera programming ka koi kaam nahi I have to work with my intellect and the other technical things जैसे कि Linux use होता है Kali use होता है उसके अंदर you just need to know the commands उसमें आपको programming coding की कोई ज़रूरत नहीं होती other people are there for you to do it uh, apart from that CGPA or GPA has never been important to me if I'm learning something at the end of the day मुझे पता है कि मैंने आज कुछ university में दो चार चीज़ें भी सीख ली तो that is enough for me so I have never been a person who would want to do internships or work whilst being in university since I believe that uh, academics को पहले handle कर लें and I thought कि graduate होने के बाद I would go for internships and everything but I believe that internships are very important for you to have a little bit of flavor of what the industry is going to be like you need to know it before my skills mattered even though I'm not a really good student according to the GPA or my transcript but I've had a lot of opportunities like I did an internship with the United Nations as a news writer for the global climate change then I had an opportunity to be the SEO writer for Facebook games which I declined because I was already working with UN and did not really have time to do that and then our university organized a seminar with a lot of CEOs in them and then there was a, a person, a spokesperson from HBL who was a chairman there from the cyber security and he offered me an internship there as well which I would inshallah be doing after I graduate. So my plans for the future are really big and uh, some people would laugh but that's okay. So 
like i said that i am really interested into cyber security and criminology so i would want to work for then my whole world is just the university so apart from everything there has been a major cultural change in me i have always been a person who uh, english bolne mein bahut acha lagta hai ya bahut comfortable lagta hai aur uh, is baat ka mera bahut mazak bhi udaya jata tha shuru shuru mein but now people have come on good terms with me ke ha isko to khair ho english hi aati hai to i could not even uh, read or write urdu jab tak main headlines padhti thi na wo news channel pe wo headline nikal jati thi aur main padh bhi nahi pati thi but i started reading urdu because apart from all this we have to keep in touch with the culture also and mix at least with the people we are living with so if i had to give an advice to those who would want to join shu so i believe that shu is an emerging university so i believe that agar somebody applies over here the faculty and the university would do everything that is possible to groom you or to make you market ready because you are basically their asset like i am somebody who's graduating the first batch of shu so har cheez ka khayal rakha jata hai ki we our batch is going to set the benchmark out in the market so har hawale se prepare kiya jata hai communication skills technical skills hard skills har cheez so even if mujhe ab choice mile ki i could go back फोर ईयर्स और कोई और यूनिवर्सिटी चूज़ करूँ तो फिर भी मैं एस एच यू ही चूज़ करूँगी बिकॉज ऑफ द इन्वायरमेंट एंड द इंफ्रास्ट्रक्चर हीयर जो कि ज़्यादातर यूनिवर्सिटीज़ में नहीं मिलती नाउ दैर आई एम ग्रेजुएटिंग सो आई बिलीव दैट इफ आई लुक बैक टू माई जर्नी ऑफ फोर ईयर्स सो आई आई एम नॉट द सेम पर्सन दैट आई यूज टू बी बिफोर माई फ्रेंड्स लाइक टू डेज बैक शी वज से मुझे ऐसा लगता है कि मेरी दो डिफरेंट लोगों से दोस्ती हुई है लवीज़ा फ्राम फर्स्ट सेमेस्टर एंड लवीज़ा फ्राम एथ सेमेस्टर टू डिफरेंट पीपल जो फर्स्ट डे की लवीज़ा थी ना वो बहुत ही नाइव थी दुनिया नहीं देखी थी सिर्फ अपना घर और अपना एकेडमिक्स एंड दैट इज़ इट बट यूनिवर्सिटी में आकर पता चलता है कि ऐसे भी लोग होते हैं इस तरीके से किसी से आपको डील करना होता है कोई आपकी नहीं सुन रहा है तो दैट इज़ फाइन जस्ट डू वॉट यूर डूइंग एंड डू वॉट योर पर्पज़ इज़ फॉर वॉट यू केम फॉर यर लोगों को सिर्फ ये लगता है कि यूनिवर्सिटी में हम दोस्त बनाने और बहुत मज़े करने आए हैं बट इट इज़ अ कम्प्लीट लाइफ साइकिल आई वुड से चार साल में शायद पूरी ज़िंदगी जी सकते हैं आप तो बहुत सारा कुछ होता है लोग आते हैं लोग जाते हैं बट यू डू नॉट माइंड दैम यू जस्ट डू योर ओन वर्क लेट दैम कम एड पॉजिटिव थिंग्स लीव दैट इज़ जस्ट अ पार्ट ऑफ लाइफ ऐसे ही होता है दे आर सर्टन पीपल इन लाइफ हु प्ले अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट रोल इन मेकिंग यू वॉट यू आर टूडे एंड फॉर मी वन पर्सन हैज़ बिन सर कॉकअप सर कॉकअप इज द काइंड ऑफ टीचर हु इज लाइक a candle in my life you know a candle burns itself to bring light in your life so sir kakab has been that for me i loved his passion for teaching and his teaching methods it's so unconventional ke main uh, even though mera course nahi hota tha lekin phir bhi mon ke class mein ja kar baith jati thi just because i wanted to learn something from him phir uh, he in my third year taught me entrepreneurship and i loved that course graduating तो मुझे पता लगता है कि कभी कभी कुछ चीज़ें ऐसी होती हैं कि जो आपको उस वक्त अच्छी नहीं लग रही होती बट इन एक्चुअल वो आपके लिए अच्छी होती हैं जो हुआ अच्छा हुआ हर चीज़ बेहतरी के लिए होती है तो कुछ दोस्त ऐसे मिले जो पहले भी साथ थे अब भी साथ हैं कल भी साथ होंगे रोज़ बातचीत होती है रोज़ मिलना मिलाना होता है दिस प्लेस हैज़ गिवन मी अ लॉर ऑफ फ्रेंड्स एंड अ लॉर ऑफ मेमरीज पीपल जो अब साथ नहीं हैं लेकिन मेमरीज हैं दैट आई कैन चेरिश लाइफ लॉन्ग एंड स्पेंड माई होल लाइफ जस्ट रिमेम्बरिंग दैट नाउ दैट बहुत कम टाइम रह गया यूनिवर्सिटी में तो सबसे जो एक लिबरेटिंग फीलिंग होती है ना वो ये होती है कि आपके ऊपर किसी चीज़ की रिस्पॉन्सिबिलिटी नहीं होती यू आर जस्ट लिविंग योर लाइफ फॉर टूडे कल की कोई प्रॉब्लम नहीं है पेरेंट्स के साइड से भी और आपके मेंटल स्टेट में भी तो एक ये फीलिंग होती है जो जिस दिन आपने ग्रेजुएट किया उस दिन ये फीलिंग ख़त्म हो जाएगी कि नाउ यू आर नॉट जस्ट लिविंग पाँच दिन किसी के साथ आप हफ्ते के गुजार रहे हो और फिर एक दिन आता है कि लाइक दिस इज़ योर लास्ट डे कुछ लोग होते हैं जो उसके बाद तो शायद कभी मिलेंगे ही नहीं तो वो सोच के मुझे थोड़ा सा दुख होता है कि जब यूनिवर्सिटी ख़त्म हो जाएगी तो दे आर पीपल हु आई एम नेवर गोन सी लाइक आई नो आई एम नॉट गोन सी दैम तो बस एक ये चीज़ है बाकी आई कैन लिव दिस लाइफ अगेन इफ आई कंटिन्यू टू डू माई मास्टर्स और एनी थिंग एल्स बट देन देर आर पीपल हु